hi guys welcome to my channel so in this video i am going to be showing you how you can add a background to a card in jetpack compose and we are also going to include text on the background so let's get started so the first thing i will do is to open empty compose activity i'll give it a name image background finish our project is now up and running i don't need this i'll delete it delete the function waiting function come here delete all this we don't need all this and delete it from here too i'll simply create a new function here i'll start with the word composable function um activity you can give it any name you want as you all know this is just a naming convention inside of this inside of this function uh, let me bring in my column i'm going to be starting with color the horizontal alignment which is going to be center and aside that i'm going to be bringing in a modifier modifier um let's say the fill fill max max size and um fill max height yep so from here i'll come inside of the column the next thing i'm going to do is to add my card and i'm going to be saying card set the elevation Elevation to be six. Let's use six dp. Six dp for the elevation. Six dp. Import this out and um, enter. The next thing is to bring in our image inside of the card. Is the first one. Um, printer. paint to resource this is where the image will be placed from the drawable i haven't added my image yet so i've copied it simply paste it in your drawable folder you can you can use um control v and you can use simple um, you can simply use paste here click on ok ok i provided the image um in the description below this is the image we are going to be using the next thing i'm going to be doing is to call the image here i'm going to say drawable dot app image the name of the image now the description you can set it to null you can set the description to null simply break it down so the next thing we are done with the image the next thing is to add our two text now let's do that come below your image i'm still inside of my card now don't forget so below of your image open a column open a column um give it a modifier we are going to be setting the pattern for it now so um modifier dot padding 10 dp let's input our text which will be for the name so i will simply call this john doe john doe let's give it a font weight font weight of um 500 let's give it 500 add a color we'll be adding a color to that and set it to white all right Next thing to do here is to add the profession. To do that, we'll repeat the same step. So I will simply copy and paste this. I'll copy this and paste it here. Change the name to software development. Sorry, software developer. Change the font width to, I think, um, let's do 200. 200. Um, 
W200. Yeah, that's fine. The color should be something like a gray. So we can add a light gray here. Light gray. We are done. So the next which we need to do is to call this home activity function. We need to call it a so I'll call it a um, activity. I'm simply going to do the same here. If you want to preview it over here, you can also do that. You simply call home activity. Now let's run our app to see the result. Here is the result of our app, but we need spaces beside it, which we neglected earlier. So simply come here and add your padding. Let's add a padding of 20 dp. 20 dp. Let's reload our app. There you go. We have achieved what we want. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you find this video helpful guys, do well to like, do well to comment, you can also share with your friends and if you haven't subscribed to this channel, subscribe today and click on the notification bell to be notified whenever I drop another video like this. Thank you so much for watching and bye for now.